Hi there, lovelies, and thank you for stepping in for today's soft and rosy bridal makeup look inspired by my new Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Quad Palette. First, start out with the lightest shade that there is. It also helps because it's numbered on the back, one, two, three, four. So this is shade number one, and apply it all over your lid, underneath your brow bone, also in that inner corner of your eye. Moving on to shade number two is this beautiful, shimmery, rosy pink color. You're going to apply this to the entire crease of your eye and then also spread it up towards your brow bone. Also, just sweep the excess underneath your under eye as well. The third shade in the palette is this beautiful rusty bronze color and you're going to apply that to the crease of your eye as well, but focus more so on the outer lid portion versus taking it up and out. The final shade in the palette is this deep burgundy brown shade and it is gorgeous to add that dimension to your eye. Apply this in soft doses because this color is definitely pigmented and you don't want to get too dark. With the remainder that's on the bristles, just blend it out and up and then even under the eye. Simply going back in with each color just to enhance them all, you're going to start out with that rusty bronze color. Simply adding a little bit more around that burgundy brown color to the upper and under portion of your eye. We're also going to go back in with that rosy color, adding even more underneath the eye. This shade is more on the fair side, so you can go heavier with this. Take that even up on the brow bone and again underneath the eye just to really blend out that rosy hue. So now that your eyeshadow is complete, what do you guys think? I think that it is beautiful, but there's finishing touches we need to do. So I'm using my liquid eyeliner right now to trace the inner corner of my eye. I'm separating my fake lash from the real lash, applying the liner in between there, and then giving it a small little cat eye wing. And even though I'm wearing falsies, yes, I apply mascara as well. I love to put it on the top just to blend my lashes in with the fake. Also, you need it on the bottom. Next is the rouge. One of my absolute favorite colors from MAC is Blush Baby. This is like the perfect rosy mauve color for your cheeks. As you can see, I'm focusing mostly right underneath that cheekbone and on the bone, sweeping it upwards out towards the hairline. The excess that's on the bristles, I will just sweep it underneath my jawline and I'll even carry it up around my hairline. I do this just to give my face a little extra color all around. For this second shade of blush, I'm using an hourglass and this is in the shade called Diffused Heat. I apply this right to the apple of my cheek. It's this beautiful pale coral color so it just really gives it more of a pop on your cheeky bones. Now highlighting the area, I'm using a highlighter from MAC and I believe this is called Emphasize. Focusing on the areas where you would have applied your concealer, so your nose, especially the tip middle of your forehead, chin, and right there in the corners of your eyes. Next, we have to go on with the shimmer highlight. I love me some highlight, and this is my new one from Charlotte Tilbury. It's the Hollywood Highlight. It's a beautiful rose goldy hue. Taking it with my brush and just sweeping it right there on top of the apple of my cheek, taking it out towards the corner of my eye. I'll also go down the bridge of my nose, the tip of my nose, forehead, the cupid's bow, and also your chin. Finishing off the look with a beautiful lip, we're using Charlotte Tilbury products and it is in the shade Pillow Talk number no. 2, or medium. I'm lining right there at the edge of my lip and I'll also shade in the outer corners of the lip. The lipstick of choice is Secret Salma. I love her lipsticks because they're just so hydrating. 
This is definitely more of that rosy pink color, but definitely has a berry undertone to it. I'm just dabbing it on so it's not too rich. To really make your lips pop and just clean it up, I'm using my MAC Studio Fix just to go around the outer edges of my lips. Now, I love a glossy lip, so I'm adding Pose Jewel from Charlotte Tilbury right there to the center of my pout and also to the top portion of my lips as well. And that completes the soft and rosy bridal look. I hope you lovelies enjoyed. You know the drill. Give it a like, subscribe it if you haven't. And until the next time, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye-bye.